today on the Rural Project, we're booking and splitting logs in the woodyard. Hi, welcome back to the Rural Project. This is Chris and uh, I'm here down on the turning circle again. On, as you can see with that sky, another beautiful day here in Melbourne, Victoria. Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to be working in the, uh, in the wood yard, getting through some firewood. So this sorry log has already uh, been through the fires a few years ago, but it, uh, it'll get cut up, it's pretty solid. Just a bit of burnt on the outside, so I'll get that cut up. We're using the trusty 462 and uh, get it cut up, get these logs split and then I'll be taking the excavator down Slippery Hill with the chainsaw and uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring as many logs up the hill as I can yep, get as many up here um, because Slippery Hill is living up to its name and we seem to be having a lot of rain at the moment and this is just too slippery to drive up and down. I'd prefer it to be able to drive down there with a the trailer behind, cut the logs and drop them in the trailer and drive out, but it's just not possible. So let's bring up, uh, bring up the logs up to here. So let's get this cut up, let's get those logs split and stacked and then we'll get down the hill. As you can see, there's a little bit of soft rot in the middle there, and the twins are just picking, picking that out, so that's something to be aware of. It certainly wasn't uh, anything that I was expecting. I thought this was a nice solid log. No doubt that runs all the way through the, the full length of it. <laughs> see then it's not as uh, not as solid as I was thinking it's gonna be it's a, it's a shame pretty soft and punky in the middle this is all good solid wood around the outside it's all red gum 
what I'm going to do we'll get the log splitter fired up and we'll get all of this wood split and then this area will be clear I will then pull the log splitter along get it out of the way put it into this area and um, and then I'll have all of that to bring all that space to bring logs up into Uh, get this log splitter moved out of the way, create myself a bit of space.